Greetings YouTube, Joe here with Color Nation Media and welcome back to the very next episode of Banjo-Kazooie. This is episode 11. In the last episode we left off after doing the whole twinkly thing and now we have to go up into the tree to claim our prize but there's a couple of things that we have to do on our way up there. First of all, I don't know why there's uh, termites up here. Seems a little bit cold for that, but anyway, this is one of the presents. I'm a present, give me to someone. Sad, I think that's what that said, but I skipped over that. Die, termite! Yeah. Anyway, that present is for those crying bear children because Boggy's an asshole. Oh, how did I miss that? Boggy's an asshole and doesn't give them their presents. So we're going to. Yeah, that's one of them. There's three, obviously. And we're going to be collecting them in this episode. Make sure to get all these notes here, although that's pretty common sense. So, yeah. And then uh, as you go up a little bit farther, I think there's feathers and then eggs. And we might need both of them, actually. Yeah, I need feathers, so I might as well get all these. I think there's ten in total. Yeah, it looks like there's ten. Cool. Cool, cool, cool beans. Let's get some uh, eggs, too, because we need those. Although we don't need all ten. Bam. And there's our jiggy for the whole twinkly thing. I'm a jiggy. Yeah, that's number one. I feel like it took us forever to get that. Get out of here. Out of the tree we go. And now uh, we need to do some serious jiggy hunting in this episode because for all the time that we were here last time, we seriously didn't get any jiggy, which is really sad. Just making sure I hit that witch switch because I kind of thought that I forgot about it, but apparently I did not. Yeah, alright, so what do we want to do first? Oh, I see a present over there hanging out. Let's go get that before I forget about him. And uh, the last ep- uh, not the last episode. I have the word episode on my mind. Brr, it's cold! Nice warm backpack for me, too! Yeah! Anyway, what I was trying to say was the last present that we need to get is going to be on top of the snowman. Um, I'm not sure exactly where, but I remember he's up there somewhere. Oh yeah, and the extra honeycomb, I forgot about that too, because I forgot about everything. And that starts off the uh, the new honeycomb for us, because we just got a new uh, energy bar thing. Thingamajiggy. Anyway, I've been saying anyway a lot lately. Not cool. I was about to say it again, actually. Yeah, we just got that uh, green Jinjo, which is pretty cool. That's the second Jinjo for this world. Get up there, Banjo. You lazy ass. Yeah, and there's a uh, Ikumbokum up there when you take off from that pad, so make sure you do that. Now we can fly around. Uh, let's see, there's a bunch of things to do, and I'm kind of just trying to decide on what I want to do first. Oh, I didn't hit the wall. Thank goodness for that. Thank goodness for that. Normally I suck at that. Alright, so I think what I want to do first is hit the buttons on the snowman because there's actually a jiggy to be found in this. So you just want to shoot yourself into the- oh, that was close. Into the buttons. There should be three of them. Like so. And then the snowman will shit out an awesome jiggy at the bottom. And uh, you have to go between his legs to get them. Ha! Funny, funny, funny. Not really. Okay, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Let me get out of here. Cool. Cool beans. Cool beans. Hey, there's a Jinjo. Mr. Blue Jinjo. Come here, sir. I think we need these feathers. We do. Fabulous. I'm sure I'll use them for something stupid coming up soon. And I'm just going to get out of here. Oh, into the water. Darn. Oh, man. Okay. I thought that was going to be all sick and awesome and... It was mostly just sick in a bad way. Anyway, we got the crapped out Jiggy. And that's gonna be number two. So we're well on our way to not getting as many as I wanted to in this episode because it's like over four and a half minutes in. All right, I'm not gonna worry about that uh, ice cube. We're gonna go up Mr. Uh, Scarf here. And obviously you can see the pattern, the notes on the yellow, the red feathers on the red squares. They're kind of like more like rectangle rhombuses. More like rhombus. These are rectangles. All right, let's not argue about shapes here. Let's just uh, make sure we get all the notes and whatnot. And that actually replenished most of my, uh, well, all of my feathers. 
which is really cool. And I'm not going to get that other one because I am lazy. You can use the shock pad. Don't worry about that sled right now because there's a couple of other things we have to get before we do that because it's going to send us down the snowman. And if you go over into his little cigar pipe, there's a jiggy in there. Yeah, my nose is coming through the uh, side of it. All right, that's number three. And I usually forget about that jiggy. It's kind of pretty well hidden. And uh, but now we have it. And there's um, going to be our third present, which is cool. Now we have all the presents, and that's going to be another jiggy uh, when we do go back to the igloo, back near the beginning of the uh, the level, the world, whatever you want to call it. Now we're going to go up and uh, head onto his hat because that's where the Jiggy from the destroying all the snowmen's are. And I found the stupid reason to use my uh, uh, golden feathers and it didn't work because I still got hurt. So I suck. Get out of here, you icicle. No, you're not even an icicle, you ice cube. All right, that's number four. We're not doing that bad. A little over six minutes in and we got four Jiggies all in a row, which is pretty cool. Do I need both of those? I do. Give me your honey. Your honeycombs. Be careful, I would use uh, the Talon Trot and use Kazooie to uh, get these notes because Banjo kind of slides around and falling from here. Uh, you're probably going to die and at least be really, really frustrated because you're going to have to get all the way back up here and that's just not fun. Anyway, we're going to go down the cool way because that's how we roll. And there's actually other stuff we needed on the snowman, but we're not going to do that right now. Oh, that was interesting. Hey, I'm on your button. I'm on your button. I'm on your button. Are we gonna land safely here? Yes. No. Damn it, that was so close. I got greedy. Alright. What to do now? I think we're gonna... I guess just fly back up and get what I needed. Do I need these feathers? I do. Bam. I like to have 49 feathers, apparently. I always go up to that amount. Alright, let's fly back up there. And I do think I missed a note, actually. So I'm going to do that first before I forget anything. Yeah, there it is. Hiding behind Mr. Beehive. Yeah. So we need to um, 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 get on the sled and hop down because... Yeah, we need to rescue Boggy. We're also going to get an Ecom Bokum from that. Number 26. Oh, jeez, that looks like it hurt. Oof. And there's the Jiggy. That's better. Hey, you found my sled. I'll go and practice for the big race now. See you, buddy. And he doesn't even take the sled. As far as we know. But we're going to take the Jiggy. Give me your Jiggy. Number five, right? Number five, number five? Yes. Halfway through the world. Awesome. And like I said before, we're not going to be able to complete this world um, because we will need the running shoes for the last Jiggy. So we're going to get nine before we head out of here and uh, head over to Gobi's Valley, which should be in the next episode. All right, let's give these little bastards their present. Yeah, shut up. Shut up. Take those presents. Your dad's a deadbeat. Yippee, now we've got all our presents. Here's something for you. And they make a Jiggy magically appear on the glass table. I'm stealing your feathers, and I'm stealing your Jiggy because that's how I do. That's going to be number six. And yeah, I'm just going to shit in their house and run away. Ready? Where should I aim it? Let's see. Mm, bam! And I'm getting out of here before I uh, yeah, get killed by Boggy. Just kidding, he's busy practicing for the big race. Duh. Even though there's nobody to race him but us. Oh, I thought I was going to get hurt right there. Ah, oh, this one's going to hurt me. I saved myself. Awesome. I am the man today. Yeah. Better than the last episode when I was just sucking a million times. And like every other episode ever. For reals. Okay, oh, there's notes in the water that we can't get right now unless you feel like using all of your golden feathers. Which I do not. So, there's no way to get over there right now unless you want to fly over there. Oh, I thought my feathers would work, but apparently not. I'm just going to do that. And I don't remember if there's anything on top of Mumbo's skull. I, there might be an extra life or something. Uh, I'm not going to worry about that right now. I'll double check on that a little bit later on because I'm failing to get up there. 
Hey Mumbos, what up? You're not hiding anything in here? Oh, there's a Jinjo up here. Mr. Yellow Jinjo, along with several notes. And now we only have one more Jinjo to get, and I know exactly where he is. And it's gonna be a while before we can get it, unfortunately. Oh well. And Mumbo's going to turn us into... A walrus. Banjo got all fat, got big teeth, her, her. Shut up, Mumbo. Dick. Alright, let's get out of here. With whatever pride we have left, which definitely is none. Because I never had any pride to begin with, lols. Alright, let's go get these notes over here first. And actually, that might be all of the notes that we have uh, left to get, in fact. Which would be cool. And really fast. Yeah, I think it might be. 93, 94. Yeah, so we're going to be done with notes. Um, if you followed along, you also should have all of them. And that was a really dumb thing to say. Cool beans. Anyway, there is a couple of uh, things that we can do with the walrus. Unfortunately, he can't attack like the uh, crocodile can. Or alligator. I think it's really supposed to be a crocodile, but... I don't know. Whatevs. Whatevs. Oh, there's an Ikambokum over there. Basically, your biggest power is that you can go into the water unharmed. Oh, hey, Mr. Walrus. Phew, it's safe for Waza to come out now. Fabulous. We're gonna come up here, and this is probably one of the easiest jiggies in the entire game. Problem is getting over there. I'm gonna make a jump for it and see what happens. Flying Walrus. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, good jump. Hey, Waza. What up? Wow, another walrus, take this! Oh, shit, he, like, throws it at us. But watch out for a smelly brown bear and his ugly feathered friend thing. Number seven, and we can go into his cave, which is actually what you're going to want to do because there's an empty honeycomb in here. Like, totally hooray. There's also a Jinjo in here that we can't get until uh, we turn back into Banjo. And Kazooie, the filthy, smelly... Bear and bird, and there he is up there hanging out. Why, hello again, Mr. Walrus. Feel free to have a look around Waz's cave. Now he has a different voice, apparently. I like to do that, just change voices randomly. So, if you go in this little tunnel, as the walrus, you can't get through here as Banjo and Kazooie, you will die a very painful death. Very painful. And there's gonna be. Another empty honeycomb. There's also an extra life, some eggs, and a couple red feathers in here as well. Get away from my extra life. Yeah, I definitely didn't need that. Extra lives are completely pointless in this game. But, uh, it's all good. I like to collect them anyway, because... It's just how I do. Yo. It's how I do. Well, what else do we have to do? We have a couple races to do, and we have to get a Jinjo. And then uh, that's going to be pretty much it. But uh, I'm going to call it quits, actually, and stop here. And in the next episode, we're going to race Boggy as a walrus. Say what? That's right. Race Boggy as a walrus. Thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you... Ooh, uh, blah, blah, blah. I can't talk. I'll see you in episode 12. Game on.